Yo, bro, I can't even post my cat on Instagram, yo. What's going on? You're probably doing it wrong. Let me see that. Ugh, <sighs> frustrated. Why, what's wrong now? Yo, I got no internet on my iPad, bro. I'm trying to watch my movies, man. Hey, you see? Ah, oh, great. Now mine too. It's not going. Yo, I need my movies, bro. It's been my life. Without it, I'm, I'm yo, I'm nothing, yo. I'm sure, man. Net neutrality is what allows us to search the web freely and it's on its way to becoming revoked. What this means is we will lose our free access to search the internet. Internet providers will be able to slow down or even ban access to certain sites, including social media. This will allow corporations to censor what they want you to have access to, as well as making you pay for website loading and uploading speeds. This may make it harder for victims of police brutality or sexual assault to get their stories heard and to get media coverage of these unjust events. This also may make it harder for protests to form due to the slowing down and censoring of social media. Think about it. If the internet provider is given money to support a specific political candidate, they could speed up the loading time of that candidate's pages, as well as slowing down or even making the other political candidates' pages unable to load. This is not only a computer problem, this will affect internet usage of phones, tablets, or other devices as well. This will also affect apps that connect to the internet. Yo, this net neutrality doesn't make sense at all, bro. Oh, I mean, I, I can't live with social media. Yo, I need my moves. I can't live without it, bro. Yo, we should fight it. Let's go do something about it. All right. The FCC, with their chairman, Ajit Pavit, voted on December 14th to repeal net neutrality. However, it is not too late. The repeal will not be put into effect immediately. There is still many steps that have to be taken for this legislation to be passed, including going through Congress. You have a voice and the right to be heard. Contact your local congressman or congresswoman today. Vote, empower yourselves and vote. Express what you stand for.